Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. Once again, I have the youngest PC champ adept, and today we're going to be challenging him up against two diamonds. Let me know how you think he's going to do down below in the comments. And if you guys like these sort of videos, then consider liking, subscribe, make sure you guys have post notifications turned on, and let's hop straight into round number one. Sneaky drones are in sight right now. Span's trying to hide this drone, trying to get it away from the site, and somehow he's actually able to escape the depth there. We're going to see... Bumblebee picking the Amara right now. Looks like he's going to be doing some sort of an Amara rush. And well, it looks like Span's going to be joining him on the Blitz. This is going to be quite a toxic 1v2, it looks like, already. With just the operators that I'm seeing being pulled out right now. Adept was trying to go for a East Stairs spawn peak. But both of our Diamond players are going to be spawning Valley side. Adept realizes this and he's going to be trying to possibly get a kill here on that East side or South side. Span now rotating from Valley Spawn. He's going to be actually droning. Possibly trying to push up into either CC or Armory. Adept going to be rotating back to site. And, well, this is going to be really difficult for him as he does not have all of the utility or reinforcements necessary to effectively hold the site properly. But it won't really matter as Span messes up and ADSs the Armory door. That's going to be the Blitz being taken out fairly quickly. And that leaves Bumblebee all by himself. And Impacts are going to go out. Leisure Mines as well. Adept doing everything and anything he can to try and delay the push-in from Bumblebee. Only one drone left, but he does have three flashes, and he's going to use those right now to try to push in to the site. Adept's going to get flashed, and he's going to stick the swing, actually. Adept just has no fear. Another flash comes out, and Adept's going to have to run from this one as Bumblebee has a lesion mine in his foot. Adept hops through the window, and a great headshot. We'll take Bumblebee out. Round number one, Adept takes it versus two diamonds. Let's go. All right, another attempted spawn peak coming out from Adept, but once again, no one is going to be over on the east side. Both of our diamond players opting to spawn Valley in. Bumblebee off of the Amaro and Span off of the Blitz for some more tame operators here, going for the ace in the line. We'll see if the operators are enough to possibly win this round. Adept also switching up his ops. No more Blitz to play against means no more Lesion. He's going to be pulling out the 1.5 on the Warden. So we'll see if this is going to work for him right now. Looks like our Diamond players are going to be trying to push together through the front door right now. We can see Bumblebee is actually droning Span in. Adept apparently is just holding the front door. He's got nothing else to do. Line scans come out from Span and here comes the push from the two Diamond players. They're going to walk straight in and shots narrowly missed Adept's head there. And a race for the Workshop door comes out as... All of the players in the lobby are rushing over towards this customs double door. Adept is just sitting directly on it, waiting. Bumblebee able to actually open up the site wall, and this is really bad because Span and Bumblebee are able to hop straight into the bomb site now. Adept realizes what's happening, and he's going to be forced to rotate off. Bumblebee is planning. Span with the flashbangs come out, and that's going to fully flash Adept, but he's warden! Ladies and gentlemen, absolutely S-tier use of his gadget. That will be Span taken out the line is gone and bumblebee has to get off of the plant because of that now going back onto it c4 in the pocket of adept he could use this to either make a site rotate or try to c4 bumblebee here comes the warden swing he's got the scanner out and the headshot as well onto bumblebee another great round from adept and honestly guys i expected when span had thrown that flash grenade for adept to lose the round but that was perfect use of his gadget there well played all right, Adept in the back of the ventilation workshop site right now, trying to get on cams and gather some info. An info he will gather is he's going to see the drone run into site, and he'll take that out. That's going to be one less drone for Span now, but fortunately for him, he's got another one pre-placed just outside of the door again. He's going to bring that in to try to drone at the site, but this time Adept won't be there to shoot it. Span now trying to use his Iana clone, doing a bunch of droning for the team here, trying to figure out exactly where Adept is, and... He's going to find exactly where now is he spots him out inside of customs. Honestly, interesting position here from Adept. He's essentially hoping that the ace isn't aiming at that specific head height. But the thing is that Span has a pre-placed drone here and he knows exactly where Adept is at. Here comes the swing here from Bumblebee. He's just inside of the supply corridor here. Adept is trying to hold this. A pre-fire comes out. The shots are going to land. Bumblebee goes down and well, it's all up to Span now who's going to be pushing on the bottom of Metal Stairs. Adept holding his ground, just waiting inside of Customs. No Diffuser for Span, so he's going to have to rotate and try to grab it off of the body of Ace. 
Z4 ran out from Adept, but Span will finally win the gunfight, and Adept is going to lose a round. Two to one now for the first split. Honestly, I think Adept is doing absolutely amazing. I think on attack, it's only going to get easier. On defense, the two players are able to rush Adept a little bit easier, but on attack, Adept can really take his time, drone out, figure out exactly where he wants to push. So I'm very confident here. I'm very confident. Also, if I didn't mention it before, make sure you guys follow Adept. I'll have all of his socials linked down below in the description. So if you guys haven't already followed him, make sure you guys do that. He's been a great help in these videos. So really would mean a lot to him and me if you guys were to do that. Okay, so it looks like... Bumblebee has actually opened up the armory wall here and he's going to be looking out through onto the armory balcony. We'll see if this maybe catches Adept off guard as you don't see this sort of angle opened up very frequently. Adept though, looks like he's just taking his time. He has so much time here to just figure out what he wants to do as the two players on defense, they do have more utility than him, but they don't have quite enough to where it's going to be a huge problem if adept takes a little bit more time to drone and plan things out all right adept finally off of drones a minute and 30 seconds left though so he is running out of time slowly but surely span going to be using his pulse scanner to try to gather some information but adept is on the other side of the map all the way outside of office door right now all of that's going to be barricaded up so going to be slowing down adept just a little bit further you can see that all the site doors are essentially barricaded the two diamond players really just trying to hold down sight and deny as much time as they possibly can. Well, my disc going to stop the grenade from going in and clearing any other additional utility and Bumblebee going to continue to throw those down. So these nades are likely going to be ineffective from Adept. Span still sitting inside of the small office, just gathering all the information that he needs to give to his teammate Bumblebee, who's going to be swinging now onto this 90 hall, but Adept rotating now into office struggling to get this office door open finally he's able to bumblebee desperately trying to get up on top of this filing cabinet we'll see if this is the angle that's going to work for him he doesn't quite get on top of the bomb he's going to fall and span now trying to rotate a little bit to see if he gets some more information but this can be really bad as adept rotating back towards 90 hall span fortunately making it narrowly back into sight but bumblebee with a headshot i think through the Fountain wall here, able to take out Adept. Great shots by him and good use of his utility there with the impact grenade. All right, Adept using IQ here, trying to gather some more information. I like the IQ pick here as, well, he was going against the pole, so it only makes sense to maybe pull out the IQ and try to counter that. Span is on Valkyrie this time instead of pulse, but either way, Adept with his little scanner with IQ will be able to spot out those cams, no problem. Bumblebee trying to hold down workshop right now and Span just doing what he does best, chucking cams, making sure that Adept is not crouch walking in from some random position. Adept doing his own drone work right now, checking out the site, trying to count heads and figure out where the two diamond players are. First, he's going to see Span and that's going to be his drone destroyed. So he has no information on where Bumblebee is at the moment. And Adept left the game. Well, that's unfortunate. Okay, so the sights and everything may have gotten a little bit messed up. We're not really sure what happens, but either way, Adept is back. The score is 2-2, so we're going to see if he's able to win this round here. The diamonds are now able to go back to the armory bomb site, so Adept is going to be doing his best to try to drone this out and figure out the best plan of attack for the armory site. Drones are going to get taken out by Span, who's running that Valkyrie again, so... Adept on this IQ is definitely a smart move as it looks like Span really loves these Intel operators that IQ so easily counters. Two minutes left on the clock and well, Adept's already got map control. He's already inside of office trying to push through fountain right now. It looks like Bumblebee is hiding in archives. He's going to be hearing that IQ and he's going to aim straight at that fountain wall just because of that. Span checking out his Valcams, trying to get some information. And Adept is on the hunt for said Valcams. He's going to spot those out. Do what he can to take them out. There's the first Valcam gone as Adept tries to push up through the 90 hall. Span is sitting here just at the top of metal, waiting to make sure Adept does not push in any farther. Bumblebee still holding his ground here in the back of archives, and it looks like we're at a little bit of a standstill here as Adept is desperately trying to figure out a way to push the site. One drone left in his pocket, but a great shot onto Bumblebee. That's going to be the Wamai taken out. Span's actually going to pick up one of his Valcams and throw the other one into the Archives bombsite. Very smart from him, but Adept going to know this with the IQ scanner. Wallbang comes out from Span, but it's not quite going to land. 
55 seconds left on the clock and Depp's really gonna have to make a move here soon if you'd like to win this span holding strong just on the top of metal stairs right now and it looks like Adept is potentially looking to rotate going back towards archives now opening up this archives door he's gonna be trying to push straight in through here span is holding behind this half wall here and he's got the head holes in the wall to try to deny the push in IQ scanner comes out once again but there's nothing to see Span with a deagle in hand. He's very confident he's going to win this one. Pulls out the MPX. 20 seconds left, and we're going to see Adept pushing all the way into sight now. Here comes the Valcam, pinging him out, but he's going to destroy that before Span destroys him. Great headshot from Span, and, well, the Diamond players are going to be up 3-2 to two right now. Looks like Adept's going to be trying to push fast through Passport here as the Iana drone out inside of sight. He's going to be... Trying to get any sort of information that he can on Span here, who's just sitting inside of sight. Very preoccupied with this pre-play C4. Not sure that they know that Adept has actually pushed into Passport. Adept trying to look for any sort of cams or anything that can give away his position. This barricade on the Passport door, though, definitely slowing him down as, well, the second he opens it, all eyes will be on him. First drum going to get shot out. So only one drone left for Adept, but fortunately he is Iana, so he'll be able to continue using his clone if necessary. Grenade in hand, and that's going to take out the shield on the bathroom door, and there goes Span C4 as well. Bumblebee sitting inside of Workshop right now, trying to hold down Adept from pushing any further out of Passport. Span getting his second drone as well now, and hopping on a cam of his own to try to Z-ping and figure out where Adept is. Free hitting the window as well. I'm interested to see what Span's plan is there. But here we are. A minute and 15 seconds left. Adept now trying to push out of Passport. But he's going to take a little bit of damage trying to do so. As Bumblebee is still holding down these head holes inside of Workshop. A great crouched angle here from Bumblebee. Will be slowing down Adept greatly. Another nade in hand. Going to decide to cancel that actually. 55 seconds left. And well things are not looking good here for Adept. Finally, Adept trying to swing into Workshop or Waiting right now. He's going to have to worry about Workshop as Bumblebee is holding a great pixel angle onto Waiting. Frost mats are certainly going to be on these Teller's windows, so that's something else that Adept's going to have to be worried about. I guess there won't be a Frost Mat there. Adept now inside of the site with only 30 seconds left. Span on cams, checking drastically to see where Adept is, but... No information will be found. Bumblebee trying to rotate out of workshop now to help out his teammate, but Adept is sticking this plant, and he's almost certainly going to get it down. Head holes in the wall now. That's going to be Frost swinging it, but he'll get taken out. But Span swings from the other door, and just as Adept looks away, he'll be taken out. GG's. Adept loses map number one, but ladies and gentlemen, we have another map to get to, so let's get straight into that one. Bumblebee and Span on attack. Trying to see what they can do against Adept. He's going to be going downstairs first round with this Warden. And he said he might be trying to bunker on site. Just barricade everything and see what he can do to hold it down. He's going to be forced to use his C4 on the rotate between sites. So no C4 utility for Adept. Drones are going to get shot out now. And uh, it looks like both of the attackers actually brought, brought their drones straight into the site. So that should be easy drone kills for Adept. All right, looks like Bumblebee is going to be rotating over to Span. They're going to be trying to push together here, possibly for a bunker take. Adept is ready for this, though. He just finished reinforcing the E-Box walls. He's setting up some head holes for the back stairs. And as he's doing that, Span's going to be throwing in his Yana clone. Bumblebee going to be pushing in behind that. Adept really worried about these tower stairs, but no one is going to be there for now. Adept going to be trying to check cams, making sure that no one is pushing his freezer or main side. You can see that he's using the barricade strap that he talked about, barricading all of the doors. Bumblebee, though, is able to actually walk into Bunker, and he's going to be able to open up this back wall. The E-Box wall is now being opened as well, and this is going to make things very difficult for Adept here. Is actually, he's in a pretty decent spot. Trying to get a kill here onto the ace. No C4 in hand, remember, so he's not going to be able to C4 any of these attackers, but he won't need to when he's hitting headshots like that. Bumblebee goes down, and it's all left to Span, who's now pushing towards Pillar. The barricade going to slow him down, though, as Adept rotates over to the hallway to try to hold down 
this pillar angle. Nade in hand from Span, and it looks like Adept heard that. The pre-fire will come out from Adept, but he won't hit it, but Span actually hits him with the grenade, doing a little bit of damage now. Second grenade comes out, and here comes a wall bang even. All the shots are going to miss. Span now checking his cam. They do have a great cam inside of sight to try to figure out exactly where Adept is, and well, he's now going to shoot that out. Span pushing through the hallway, and Adept knows this. He hears it. Minute and 10 seconds left. He's going to swing, and I guess he didn't hear it. Span pushes up further than Adept expected, and Adept gets taken out. Round number one goes straight to the Diamond players. Span and Bumblebee going to be pushing above. Possibly we're going to see some form of a big window push here. Adept trying to destroy the glass in the window so he's able to hear where the attackers are pushing from. Span going to hop straight outside by the white window, and it looks like he might be trying to push the white stairs. Right now, see Bumblebee trying to push the big window, so... Looks to me that we're going to see a big window and top white take, but Adept is ready for this. He's already top white, and he's ready for the walk-in from Span. Adept is already on about 20 HP now. We missed the gunfight, but I think Bumblebee lit him up a lot, and that's going to be a big problem now as Span is pushing the top of the white stairs. He's got the info for these nades, and, well, we could see a tragic nade from below here depending on how this goes. The nade is going to miss, and it looks like Bumblebee now rotates off of the big window, allowing Adept to move more freely within the site. Drones go up top white, and one's going to get shot out. Bumblebee going to be pushing at the top of the white stairs, and he's going to be taking about half of his HP right now, and I think there's going to be a nade from below. And, well, what do you know? Nade from below will take out a depth span just with this info. He's too good. All right, span and Bumblebee spawning construction side. They're looking to do some form of possibly a big tower push right now. Adept is going to be once again going top floor. He really wants to win this site. Let's see if he's going to be able to do it. Span, once again, these pre-placed drones from the two diamond players has been genuinely impressive. But right, here comes a peek from the kid's window. I was really looking forward to Adept maybe getting a kill there, but Span and Bumblebee are actually going to push straight in through the tower door into the green hall. Now, it looks to me that Span might be trying to go for some more nades from underneath. It only makes sense when you've got the pre-placed drones in sight the way that he does. And Adept, he sees this. He goes in the cam. He sees that Span is below. And he decides, you know what? I'm just going to go ahead and flank. But Span seems to already be ready for this. He's literally just holding an angle here. But it doesn't matter. Adept's got the faster reaction time. He's going to take him out. And, well, he hears Bumblebee pushing up as well. He's thinking to himself, do I hold this or do I rotate back to site? He's going to choose to rotate back to site. And it's going to be a mad dash to see who gets there first. Attackers It'll obviously be well. Adept as Bumblebee decides to hop on a drone instead. Pushing up to the top of White Stairs. The swings are coming out. No shots hitting from either players. A C4 is going to be thrown out, but that'll miss as well. At most, just destroying some of those gridlock traps. Adept now going to be trying to prone in Canadian. Let's see if this works for him. Bumblebee going to be rotating all the way back towards Trophy Stairs. So far... Looks like this positioning is not going to work for Adept as he hears now that Gridlock is inside of Trophy. He's going to turn around and try to do his best to hold this door down. One minute left, so honestly, Bumblebee has all the time in the world to try to work this round. Because of that, Adept is going to have to be very, very careful about how he swings this, but it won't matter when he's hitting headshots like that. Both players go down and Adept able to clutch up at least one defense round versus these two diamonds. All right, Adept's first drone is going to be shot out, or actually his second drone, so no drones for Adept anymore. He does have the Iana clones, but he's going to have to wait for those to recharge if he wants to use them. Grenade in hand, and he sounds like he thinks there's someone inside a master, but he's definitely hearing the audio wrong. No one is inside a master. We do have Span, though, inside of games slash dorms, trying to figure out exactly where Span or uh, Adept is. The Solus, though, actually able to see a little bit better than Span is exactly where Adept is coming from. And I have to say that just, once again, the information coming out from the two Diamond players is unbelievable. They have a Pulse and a Solus right now. If you can't understand how that's insane, I don't know what to tell you. That is that is some next level information ops going on right now. Either way, though, a minute and 30 seconds left. Adept doing whatever he can, but what can he do? He's got Span looking at him 24-7 through the wall. And if he gets on drones, then, well, Solus knows exactly where he is as well. But I guess he won't anymore as Adept swings and takes him out. Adept's still on full HP, so he might be able to win this round here. He's going to try to bait out Span, but he's got the pulse scanner, so he's going to know that he's getting baited. Nade in hands now, and Span's going to be 
Still pull scanning, trying to stop Adept from pushing in right now. The C4 is actually a little bit of a problem for Adept, believe it or not, but the sprint in from Adept and oh no, a trade comes out. Adept will kill Span, but because Adept is on attack, the defense will get the rounds absolutely tragic all right we'll give adept a point all in our hearts okay we'll say this game is two to two to two just for adept but realistically here adept's gonna have to try to win two more rounds if he wants to bring this to ot it's certainly possible it's certainly possible these rounds have been exceptionally close okay adept choosing to bring knock this round and a little bit less droning here He's going to be trying to be a little bit more aggressive and possibly stop the defense in their setup here. We see that Bumblebee is actually still reinforcing and Span still setting up his echo cam. So a rush could work out for him here, but these barricades are certainly going to slow him down. Looks like Adept's going to be spending his time just trying to open up a few of these barricades just to give him multiple different ways to push in later in the round. But actually, he's going to drop the hatch instead. He impacts it open with the grenade and just instantly drops. Span's still on cams. He has no idea where Adept is. And well, Span's dead now. Just crouches out of freezer. He will be taken out. And Adept walking in directly behind Doc. That'll be Bumblebee taken out as well. And ladies and gentlemen, that's exactly what we needed out of the depth right there. We needed him to be confident, get off the drones and run in and shoot people. Now, that's exactly what that echo gets, bro. <laughs> I'm telling Dude. you, bro. All the all the info, they had a Solus and a Pulse on you, bro. Like, <laughs> yeah, bro. that is insane. Like, oh my God, so hard to... Oh, um, but... Dude, it's just like... They want it, like, like I want it a lot, but they just want it like, a lot as well, and I don't know, you can't really do much when you have two people who want it a lot versus one person who wants it a lot, you know what I mean? You just have to want it a little bit more. All right, Adept going to be Amarring straight in through the uh, the big tower here. Span rotating back down to site after he went all the way over to dining just, just to take Adept's drone, but hold on a minute. How is Adept 1 HP? I must have missed this, but... He must have fallen off of Big Tower and put himself on a 1 HP. I don't see any other way he would be so low. And that is a critical error as both Span and Bumblebee are safe in sight behind their reinforcements, their barricades, and their Aruni traps. And, well, they're both full HP. The hatches are soft, but Adept doesn't have any hard breach gadget on the Amaro to open them up. So it isn't really going to matter. A minute and 30 seconds left. Adept's going to be trying to aggressively push down the stairs. And honestly, like I said, this is exactly what we need to see from him. He's got the flashbangs to burn the Saruni gate, and he's going to do exactly that. Burning the gate now and trying to push deep into the site. But here comes someone to peek his hallway. Span on the Mozzie, just pushing in aggressively right now. But who's going to push more aggressive? It's going to be Span. Adept tried to push deep into the site, but it's just not going to be enough. And ladies and gentlemen, the Diamonds are going to beat the champion Two to our two to zero oh in the series. Well played to the diamonds. Well played to adept. Make sure you guys follow him with the links down below in the description. Make sure you guys check out Six Shot Academy. Join that. Also, make sure you guys are subscribed. Turn on those post notifications. Like the video if you guys enjoyed. And with all that being said, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in tomorrow's video.